y'all welcome back to the channel so your girl is back with another thrift with me slash vlogging video we're gonna start this video off in my local goodwill let's just go in and see what we find so girl the first thing that i put my hands on were these really cute um blue kind of wood grain pants they were super cute but i didn't end up getting them because girl they was a size four and there's no way i can squeeze a piece of thigh in the size four but i saw this really bomb victoria's secret top um i didn't end up getting it because i really wish that they had either the pants or some shorts with it because i do like grabbing sets especially you know when i gotta be around the parents i need on a full pajama girl and i love america eagle and i saw these cute bermuda shorts um i did end up leaving them though because i do feel like i have quite a few pair but i do like um american eagle jeans i like the way they fit they are good for you curvy girls so i tend to grab them but i left them that particular day this little gold dress she was super cute hanging on the rack i was trying to think of like girl where i'm gonna wear this where am i gonna wear this dress the back out all of that super cute but it was a small so i did end up leaving it but she was um a really cute dress and y'all already know that i love the camo and so anytime that i see a camo anything i put my hands on it but this one you see the little stains or whatever in the back I just wasn't in the mood. I didn't feel like that day thinking I was going to do something with it. So I went on to the Thrift Saving Way thrift store. I had passed this one on my way to Goodwill. And I was like, okay, let me just pop in here and see what's, what's, what's really good. So Huntsville has a few of these stores around the area. Some stores are definitely better than others. And this particular store, come on, piece of scripture. Girl, we all for the motivation. But this particular store really wasn't the vibe. But I do like thrift stores like this because, y'all, you never know, you know what I'm saying, what you're going to find. So I never discount any store that I see because a lot of times the ones that you think don't have really anything in it, it'll be that one or it'll be that two little piece of gem that you find. Or sometimes I will rack up in the entire store based on, you know, the gym, the one that you wouldn't think anybody would be going into. Now it was organized, you know, as much as possible. Things were not just thrown out over the place. They had the sections where the store, where the stuff was located. So I, you know, I, I can't discredit it. And of course I could probably find some of anything in this store and put it together. But lately I've just been trying to find you know, the unique pieces, the pieces that I know as a reseller that I can definitely sell. Um, so I don't waste a whole lot of time these days just buying random stuff. But I did see this really cute blazer. It was a New York and Company chocolate and kind of gold champagne color. It was cute. I did prefer if it would have been just slightly a bit little longer. But um, it was cute. It was $5. I probably could have got it. But your girl ended up leaving that blazer in the store. But girl, I did find this little gem. So this was the one thing that I did walk out the store with. It was this really bomb pink and black bag. Super, super cute. I love the detail on the strap. I love the shape of it. I love the two-tone. I love the moon effect. Super bomb. So your girl bounced on up out of Thrift Savings Way. And then, y'all, I went to one of my favorite spots, um, America's Thrift Store. Y'all already know I share America's Thrift Store all the time. It's just one of those stores when I go in, I give it about a week. Then I go back just to see what's up in that thing. So, girl, let's just get right into the pieces that I found. So, on this particular day, the sale was 50% off the gray. And it was 30% off the yellow tags. And usually when I go in, I bust a right real quick, girl. And I go straight to the bags. Let me just browse, see what I can find, see what pops up. So for me, you know, I really don't just stand and thumb through every single piece in the store. This one, because it was super bright, um, it just popped out to me. It was cute. I didn't end up getting it, but I did love, you know, the color on it. But I usually just try to find something that, you know, catches the eye. You don't have to put your hands on every single piece, every single piece single thing because not everything is going to work in the store so you just kind of have to just browse just browse with a good eye see what you can find now i did see these really cute shoes um i love the color y'all know i'm anything snakes print animal print nine west but i did leave those in the store this blazer i really wanted to grab but child girl that piece of neck that piece of neck on this blazer done been through it love the color love the pattern love the tone on tone but i just wasn't finna feel like putting in the work to try to make sure i can get that neck clean so i ended up leaving that in the store and y'all i had to pause for the cost because your girl is all about the piece of fitness and i do take you know my fitness very serious um i really got on the grind with that so i absolutely love days when i can go in the gym y'all and it is empty 
Ain't nobody in there to bother your girl. Ain't nobody in there to taking up the machines, which is kind of the reason why I really like this gym vice. Like, you know, the Planet Fitnesses and the LA Fitness. Girl, I need to have access to all the machines when I go in. I don't want to have to compete. You can't compete when you can't compel. So I don't want to be competing for the piece of machines just for me to get in here and do my little 40 minute get down. And then, girl, I'm out. But I bounced on over after I left the gym and went to Target because I wanted to... Um, see a couple of tops that i've seen the girlies kind of share over on tiktok so girl tiktok is a trap tiktok will have you girl going to target going online tiktok will have you all over the place from beauty to fashion girl to home and so what i really wanted to check out were these tops um these tops y'all are super cute on i think i posted some looks with me especially i know i posted in the lavender one i seen another girly with this pretty green color so i did end up grabbing both tops or all three of them actually and they were like 16 dollars. super cute um but Target girl had your girl in the church choco, period. I just, it's Target. And then I saw this really cute tee, and I love the pink with the little tie-dye splatter situation on it. I did end up leaving it um, in Target, but it was cute. And then, of course, since I left the gym, I needed to get me some protein in from all the weightlifting. So I grabbed me one of these little core powers. Really, really good. I saw this candle that I thought was super nice. Um... I'm not a big, you know, this old Magnolia vibe. It's not necessarily my style, but, um, girl, I wasn't finna pay $30, though. But I did love the vase on it, so who knows? Um, maybe when it go on sale. And if y'all don't know, my house is really giving, like, ethnic, tribal, travel vibes. Um, I'm getting ready to kind of refocus a little bit and kind of do a little switch up in the house and do some more home decor type things that I used to do prior to me really being heavy with sharing content and thrifting. Girl, I stayed trying to redo something to my house. Painting, girl, restyling stuff, moving stuff. But then I saw these two, these black art pieces and I thought they were really, really bomb. Um, I'm not sure exactly where I'm going to put them, but I did end up grabbing this, um, this piece right here. Super bomb. I actually kind of like this piece. I don't know. Pops, Gramps is giving me a little vibe, but, um, I didn't end up getting it, but it is, I do like the fact that it's kind of giving like a little vintage vibe to it. Super cute, but I did end up leaving that one in the store, but y'all Target be the vibe. Like, come on, piece of, ugh musicians like this would be super cute if you got a music room in your house to throw that in the little b girl only because of beyonce but the little bees were really cute i could see this kind of maybe put into like an office or a craft room but girl i left target and girl we back down to the people goodwill so first thing i put my hands on down to the goodwill girl with these blue boots these electric blue boots i really didn't want to get them at first because they was twenty dollars but the only reason why i did grab them is girl i don't have anything blue in the closet as far as my shoes i need blue shoes i need to find me a really bomb blue bag so i'm gonna find it thrifting but just patience and time girl these really cute um pretty little thing pants super cute i think i sold these on my last live sale so if you're not following me on instagram girl i had my live sales on all the things that i'd be finding thrifting because i can't keep it all i have to purge i have to get rid of some of this stuff but those were super cute i saw these shorts i almost wanted to get these too um i did like the roughed edge on these but y'all i have plenty of shorts so i did end up leaving these shorts in the store but i did go in the dressing room and try the pants on like i said i ended up having to sell them because the pants were like a size six and child girl they were too tight around the thighs i could not so those ended up down to the girl piece of resale and then i saw them with a really cute little um cowrie b bralette that i had got from forever 21 super cute little situation but i did end up leaving these in the store and y'all already know i wasn't gonna leave out of goodwill without trying on these electric blue booties super cute they were the perfect size i really love them super comfortable so i can't wait you know for the seasons to start to change and then i can pop out with all the boots and the coats y'all and the sweaters I, fall is my season for getting dressed and i just absolutely love the thrift stores so i went on over to thrift mart yellow was 50 percent off green was 30 percent off and so i browsed through the swimsuit section 
which was up in the front. I thought this was cute. This little brown chocolate lime situation. Um, I didn't end up getting it. I kind of wish, number one, it was $10, but I kind of wish it had a little bit more of an animal print kind of going on. Um, and I probably would have really, you know, snatched her up. I saw this really cute polka dot um, red and white belt. I did end up grabbing this because this will be perfect to cinch almost really anything. A dress, a blazer, super cute. I saw this orange dress. I like the back of this dress. This dress was super cute, and I love that it had the button. So, you know, you can always leave a button open, girl, and show a little piece of thigh. But it was a size six, and girl, I couldn't even get my arms in that thing. One arm, second arm was a no-go. But I really loved um, the color. And $7, $8 wasn't too bad. If you seen my video, girl, this was the day that I grabbed those canary diamonds. Girl, I grabbed the canary diamond tights. I was super excited when I saw those. Girl, they just, they, they called me. I didn't call for them. They sent for me. So since they sent for me, I had to grab. Super bomb went on those. And then I saw this um, the same day I grabbed this um, really pretty um, Fashion Nova gold dress. Now the dress is super long on me. If you saw my shorts, um, you saw where I had styled this one up. And it was really cute though. Um, and I did get it, I think, you know, it was 50% off for $5. So I snatched this up. This pretty little thing dress was super bomb. Y'all, if this dress was my size, I would have gotten it. But it was a size 16, but I sold it on live. Girl, why they had it over here in the men's t-shirt section? Like, sis, you can't run that bag. Sis didn't want to run that bag. And they had this dress here. It was from Target. I didn't end up getting it. It's a Who What Wear brand. I mean, it was kind of cute. Um, it had pockets. I thought about it. But again, y'all, I'm just trying to, for me personally, I just want the pieces that really, you know, speak. But thanks for hanging with me.